Hey there, Becca here from Inside the Square. In this tutorial, I'm gonna walk you through the two simple steps you can take to use an image for the background of your mobile menu in Squarespace 7.1. Now, before we dive into anything super important, this is for version 7.1. If you're using an older version of Squarespace, your code is gonna be different, and I have two separate tutorials listed below. But if you're in the latest version, you're in the right place. Let's go ahead and hop into my demo site, and I'll show you just how easy this is to do. So here we are in my demo site, and you'll see we only have two steps outlined on this page. What we're going to do is upload your image to your custom files, and then we're going to replace this part of the code with your image URL. I'll walk you through it step by step. First things first, let's head to design and scroll down to custom CSS. Now down here you'll notice we have a manage custom files button. That is where we're gonna upload the image that we're gonna to wanna to use. So if I select manage custom files, I can just drag and drop it from my computer right there and it'll upload. So the next thing we need to do is take this code, which is listed in the description below, and paste it into our custom CSS. Now right here where it says URL goes here, I'm gonna remove that line, open up my custom files, and just click on that image. And Squarespace is gonna put that URL in there for me. Now let's go ahead and take a look in our mobile preview here, and you can see we now have the cement background for our mobile menu. I'll remove that code so you can see what it looked like before. I just had a solid color. Now that I've added that code, we have that as a background. Now one last part of this code here says background size cover. If I remove that, it's gonna stretch the image out and it'll look really wonky. So make sure you leave that background size cover in there. It serves an important purpose. Go ahead and select save when you're done and you'll be good to go. And that's it for this super simple tutorial. Upload your image into the custom files section and then using the code in the description below, replace URL goes here with the new URL for that image that you just uploaded. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something awesome and most importantly, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now. If you like this tutorial, you'll love my CSS cheat sheet. With over 30 pages of pro tips and code snippets specific for Squarespace, you can customize your site way beyond your design menu. Download your copy today at insidethesquare.co forward slash CSS. That's insidethesquare.co forward slash CSS.